Hey y'all, in today's video, I want to share with you my lithium battery setup that I have for my live scope. Um, and I think it may surprise a lot of you if you hadn't seen this kind of setup already. If you enjoy this video, please give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button. I'd appreciate your support. And any comments you have, I'll be happy to answer them. If you haven't seen the way I set my uh, live scope up, I did it myself. I built my um, pole that I put my transducer on. Here it is right here. I built that all up. And I built, you know, I didn't build a box. I bought the box. And I mounted the uh, the uh, live scope. Um, oh shoot, I don't know what that is. That black box that it runs off of inside there. Um, but I, and I have a, a link to that right up here in my other video. You can go check it out. But I want to show you what I've got in here. Okay. So what I did was, <clears throat> as you can see, I've got two batteries in here. I'm going to unhook them. And it's just those Dakota, the Dakota lithium 12 volt, 10 half hour batteries. And I'm going to tell you what, those work great. This one here, I, I've got Velcro on the bottom. I put Velcro in there on the uh, bottom of the box so that it'll hold it. I just stick it in there. And then uh, when I want to use it, I just plug it up here. I went ahead and bought two of them just in case, you know, I needed it. That gives me, you know, 20 hours, 20 amp hours. The way that I use this thing is I've got both of my, my graph and the box hooked together on this one battery. And this battery will last me six hours of solid fishing without turning that unit off. And I've got a neighbor who actually showed me uh, what he had, how his setup was. He's got one and he has just his black box mounted to it and then he has his graph going to the regular uh electrical down inside of his boat and uh his will work and last at least eight hours and i'm never you know i don't fish more than about five hours at a time and so the one battery has worked fine for me doing that these things are only around a hundred dollars um, and i'll put a link down below in the description of the video so you can look at them and check them out. I mean, they're not like those, you know, that are a thousand bucks. I mean, these are just small batteries and they charge really quickly. I bought a charger with them. The charger was like $17, I think, maybe 18. And, uh, you know, I just, when I get home, I take one out, I leave one in and I charge this one or which one, whichever one that I use for that particular day, I charge it, I stick it back in there you know you maybe i've got it hooked to the other one for the next day and then i'm vice versa i just rotate them out which i could get away with just one but I, I just chose to buy two just to be safe and uh so you know prior when i first started and got live scope i ran a battery or you know a, a wire and i ran it all the way through everything you know going to the to the back of the battery or going to the big main battery in the back and if you've watched any of my videos, I've been stranded three times from that thing running my cranking battery down. And now a lot of that might be my fault because I don't have an onboard charger for my cranking battery. And uh, be honest with you, I, I forget to charge it regularly. But if I'm just running my other electronics and my boat, I never have to charge it. It, it stays charged all the time, all year long. So with it going dead it's that graph that's pulling the juice and i just i just don't have any trouble with that lithium battery one i made a particular video i i got to the lake and my battery was totally dead and i did a video just fishing without electronics i'll link it up here too you can check it out if you want to um so anyway that's how i've got mine rigged if you haven't already please hit the thumbs up and subscribe and hey turn that little notifications bell on so you won't miss any of my videos because uh, I know that a lot of guys don't get to see them because they don't know that it even it even came out. So uh, I appreciate you joining me. We'll see you on the next one.